the skills you need that I think you need to be a foster carer is a sense of humour, not to take things personally. You need to be very understanding, encouraging, um, just, just a normal person, just be you. My name is Michelle and I've been fostering for West Sussex for about 26 years. I had a young child of my own and didn't want to go out into to work, to back to an office. So I decided that I would work from home and look after teenagers. And it worked really well because obviously the, I could give individual attention to my child during the day. And when my child was abed, the teenager had me to themselves. A lot of them just need a safe place first, somewhere where they can feel safe, secure, um, someone that's in their corner will listen to them, fight for them, um, encourage them. You know, simple things we take for granted with our own children that you just do instinctively. Sometimes I've never had that before. I'd say about 95% of my foster children keep in touch with their families. They'll come to see me. Some call me Nan, which is lovely. Um, I've actually seen um, a foster child that I had give birth, so that was pretty special. To me, they're all successful in their own right, you know, whether it's going catering college or whether it's going to university. It's more a case of what haven't I got, you know. Seeing all these children that come in through your door as one thing, um, when they leave, they're totally somebody else. You know, I like to give them a sense of being, sense of self-worth, so that, that they can be whatever, you know, whatever they want in life it's there if they want it. A lot of people do think that, you know, fostering teenagers is going to be really hard work, trouble, police at your door every day, and that's really not the case at all. Once they, once they feel safe and secure, they slot into your routine, they just want somebody that will vouch for them, care for them. What I would say to somebody um, thinking about fostering that was in my position all those years ago is go for it. There is help out there. You can work from home, be with your own children. I've had lots of support really over the years from West Sussex, lots of training um, on probably every subject under the sun that you need. There, there's, there's always help or a training course to go on to. You don't have to be, um, you know, a, the standard nuclear family, well off in your own home. You know, there's lots of different families suit lots of different children. That's all they need is a chance and they just need somebody to be there to know that you know they're not going to give up on them and it's it's just nice to change lives and and we do as foster carers